Most people wouldn't ordinarily associate Canada with beach volleyball players, but Ontario natives Heather Bainsley and Sarah Pavin are determined to put Canada on the map. It was just a year ago that the two decided to join forces. Bainsley, an experienced beach player, began her outdoor pro career after graduating in 2006. But when she lost by only one game in her attempt to qualify for the 2012 Olympics, she was ready for a change and took a big risk by taking on indoor player Sarah Pavin as her partner. You know, I just wanted to prepare as best I could for 2016 and if there was a time to take a chance, um, 2013 was the year. And another thing too is that I knew Sarah was an incredible athlete and volleyball player and uh, you know I didn't I would be crazy to give up that opportunity to um, try out a partnership with her. Sarah Pavin has played indoors her entire life. In fact, she was the youngest woman ever to be selected for Canada's senior national team. Pavin played for Canada until she was 18 when she decided to pursue a degree at the University of Nebraska. She graduated in 2008 with several top flight honors, including the Collegiate Player of the Year in 2006. She continued to play indoors around the world, but after not qualifying for the 2012 Olympics at age 26, she knew she needed to make a change before time ran out. I'm getting older, so I was like, I have to do something if I want to make this a reality. And, you know, we have Heather, who's been playing for a long time on the beach, and she's very talented. So, um, luckily, she decided to, to take a risk and take me on as a partner. and. Hopefully we'll make a go of it. With one thing on their mind, the Olympics, the two have been training nonstop to make that dream a reality. To devote your entire life to one specific goal and not achieve it, for me, I wouldn't be able to live with myself for not making the full effort. Um, so, you know, I'm gonna give it one more go. And at the end of the day, if it happens, amazing and if it doesn't I'll know that I gave everything I possibly could to make it happen. Making the Olympic team is anything but easy. Pavin and Bainsley have spent their last year far from home training in Southern California and competing everywhere but their native Canada in order to represent their homeland. Their home away from home is Hermosa Beach where they are trained by Scott Davenport who played professionally for 13 years. Although the process can be taxing, Pavin and Bainsley understand that this is what it's going to take to make their Olympic goals happen. It's grueling, you're on the road for months at a time, and just dealing with the pressure of having to qualify and making, you know, making the top 16. And um, yeah, I think just believing in ourselves and believing that the time that we've put in is, is what we need to do to, to get there. In the 1996 Olympics, Canadian team John Child and Mark Heath surprised the world by taking home a bronze medal. On the 20th anniversary of that win, Pavin and Bainsley are hoping to have that same success. This is Cecily Seljuskog of the Cronkite Los Angeles Sports Bureau.